welcome to my channel if you are new here hello if you are spiritually connected with katiba that's for sure look i don't know who needs to hear this but do it scared do it alone do it broke do it scared do it alone do it broke i promise you it's so much beauty on the other side of fear like i'm at the point where I'm doing stuff scared and all. Like I'm I'm shaking in my boots doing it. But then when I do it, I be like, oh shoot, I'm so glad I did it. Ugh. I'm so relieved that I did it. Oh, you would it like if you it, it it's like the saying, if you never ask the answer, it's always gonna be no. If you never go for it, it's just never gonna happen. But if you go for it, it's like it could either happen or it cannot happen. It can happen in the way in which you want it to happen, it can happen in a different way. But if you never do it, it won't happen. Like, do it scared. Do it scared. It's scary, of course, but if your goals don't scare you, then you're not, they not big enough. Like, you're not dreaming big enough. Like, do it broke. Do it broke, that's when your faith comes in. It's like, do you really trust the universe or not? Do you really feel like your life is in God's hands or not? Or you like just be like just talking like do it broke. Don't be afraid to spend money. That's what it's here for. Like have faith that you're going to get it back tenfold. Like have faith that you're always going to be taken care of, especially as a chosen one. Like have faith that you can chase your dreams Like you can. Uh, do whatever you believe you're calling to to be and that finances and that things materialistic things in this world like that stuff is going to be taken care of for you like it always have been like right when stuff like just like the times where stuff just came right on time for you like do it alone <laughs> somebody really needs to hear this do it alone we as human beings we don't connect with ourselves enough we don't connect with ourselves enough. And I hear so many people just on social media alone saying how they could never do stuff alone. They're making it weird for you to go out to eat by yourself, especially to take a trip by yourself. Like you out shopping by yourself. It's like people are looking at you in a certain way. They're looking at you like you're lonely. But no, there's a group of us out here who like, we are content. We are comfortable with ourselves. We are all that we need do it alone that's scary in itself when i first went on a trip by myself a lot of y'all seen it um some of my day ones like i went on a trip i got on a plane by myself the funny thing is like a week or so prior my son took his first flight by himself like he took his first flight before me. <laughs> I took my first flight. Like, that gave me confidence in itself. Like, if I can go send him on a flight and he perfectly fine, like, I can go get on this flight, which I have already been planning to do. But it's scary. In a foreign country, like, it's one thing to go out to eat by yourself, go shopping by yourself. But hopping on a plane, taking a trip by yourself, like, that's top tier that's next level and that was one of the scariest things that i had to do but it really wasn't all like that like it's just like because i trust i got so much faith i trust and i knew that everything would be okay everything will be what it's supposed to be everything is already written anyway so it's like it's not much that scares me nowadays or i may be fearful for a while but I'm so scared that I'm going to just do it. Like, I'm so scared, I'm going full force. Like, it's like when you uh, get into a fight, you scared, they riled up, you ain't got no choice but to swing on them first because <laughs> you're just that scared. Like, keep that same energy when it comes to bettering yourself, when it comes to your peace, when it comes to your happiness. Like, do things because you want to do it. Do things because it makes your heart flutter. Do things because it gives you butterflies. Like, do things because it make you feel good and it bring you joy. Even if you have to do it alone, 
even if you have to do it broke. Like I literally seen, it's it's a chick on um, Instagram. I don't know her name or nothing, but she be popping up in my algorithm and she's, um, she's in Costa Rica. And she talks, her story is how she had like some low amount of maybe some change in her bank account. She spent the rest of her money on literally moving out there, not knowing how she was gonna make a way for herself. But she had that much faith in, that's how, um people like myself master manifestors like this is how we're able to get through in life because we just have that much faith we got that much faith is no way around it no doubt about it that it's gonna work out like moving to a place where things where you know that things are gonna work out for you regardless even if they don't go in the way in which you hope for them to go you think that they will go that they're gonna work out and they're gonna work out for your better good do it just do it like nike they did that they did that with that 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 slogan like just do it no matter what if your soul is yearning for you to do it do it do it your soul know what it wants your soul know what it desires and your soul usually know what's best now your mind that mind <laughs> that mind is a whole nother thing that whole is that mind is a whole nother entity that mind be working that mind will that mind is where that fear comes in that mind is where that ego uh likes to hang out at like but when you begin to crush your ego when you begin to fight against your mind and your ego that's when your higher self steps in and this is where you say like i'm sick of not doing stuff because nobody wants to do it. I'm sick of not doing stuff because I'm too afraid to do it and I just want to stay in my comfort zone. This is where your soul steps in and say that I'm sick of doing not doing stuff because I don't have it. I'm going to take what I have and I'm going to do it anyway. And I'm going to figure the rest out as it comes. I'm going to figure the rest out later. I'm going to have these experiences because I'm not going to just be sitting in the same place doing the same thing like and, and you and, and when you start to do that and you start to show the universe that hey this is what I want then that's when the universe start working with you like we co-create with the universe we co-create with the universe some people sit back and they wait on stuff to start happening or stuff to start start showing up and when that don't happen they're like oh well maybe it's just not meant to be no you got to get out there you got to show god what you really want you got to put it out there you got to show that you serious about it and watch how things start aligning for you watch how your mindset starts to change watch how the people around you start to move watch how things are starting to move around for you for your better good watch how things work out for you when you start to show the universe what it is that you want just i mean i'm a living testimony i don't know if y'all know like i haven't worked a real job since 2017 like i haven't had a nine to five job since 2017 and i don't plan on getting one yes there's some times where i could use one but it's like I already, like, I already know. I don't want no job. I don't want no job. <laughs> but somehow it's like, I can spend my last, I can, like, I can do what it is I want to do. I can go where I want to go. Like, I can, uh, I can do whatever. And it works out for me. It works out for me. It's like in a nick of time, and some people don't like to live like that, and I totally understand it. And this is not just how my life is. Like, oh, every time in a nick of time, something just falls in for me. It's like, nah, stuff just works out in my favor. And it's because I'm doing what my soul desires. It's because I'm doing stuff scared. It's because I'm doing stuff broke. It's because I'm doing stuff alone. No, I don't live a broke life, okay? No, I'm not just like, oh, I take every penny I have and I just spend it. But it's like, there have been times where I was down, down. And because my faith, because of my faith, like, because I've been like a good person, 
because like I'm out here doing playing my part. I'm out here help, helping raise the vibrations. I'm rewarding in, ret in return. So it was like, be a good person. Be a good person and watch how things work out for you. Do it. Just do it. It's so many people who they perish this earth. Like they move on and who knows where they go next. Like some people come right back. Some people go somewhere else. They're so, but it's like in this lifetime, you're here right now. We have, it's people who have so many things that they say that they want to do. It's so many, but they defeat themselves instantly. In their mind, they tell themselves like, I can't do that. I don't have the money. I can't do that. That's going to take too much time. I can't do that. I won't be able to get off of work. I can't do that. They make every excuse for themselves. So once you do that, once you have that amount of doubt, like it's already over with. The first step is believing that you can do it. Believe in yourself. Believe in yourself like you believe in that job. Believe in yourself like you believe in that um, whatever. I ain't going to go where I was about to go. But <laughs> believe in yourself. And believing in yourself, you're believing in God. So if it's something that you want to do, I just want to encourage you to do it. Yes, it probably is scary. And that just mean like you're on the right track. That mean that you you on some bossy stuff. Like you, if your goals scare you, like you on some top tier, top notch type stuff. Like if it's something that you want to do and it scares the crap out of you, like it's probably for you. It probably is. It probably is. Because your soul is like, just do it. What's the worst that can happen? I mean, it's either going to be a yes or it's going to be a no. Or it's going to be a not now. <laughs> not now, but you're in the, you're headed in the right direction. So I hope this video inspires somebody. I hope it encourages somebody. If it do, let me know how so in the comment section below. If you're new here, I do invite you to hit that subscribe button. That is all I have for this video. Stay spiritually used. Stay spiritually in tune. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.